Google just launched the latest in the Gemini family of multimodal large language models, Gemini 2.0 Flash Experimental. Google Maps is finally entering its Gemini era. Coming to Google Maps, you'll soon be able to ask a pretty specific query within the search bar of Google Maps itself for specific recommendations on things to do. You can be pretty granular with it. Google has launched Gemini 2.0 Flash Thinking, an AI model breaking barriers with its record-setting benchmarks and groundbreaking transparency features. During its beta phase, it's completely free, a sharp contrast to OpenAI's premium models, where costs for advanced capabilities like the O3 model can range from $20 per task to $3,500 for high compute operations. Gemini 2.0 stands out for its ability to handle extensive workloads efficiently, redefining accessibility and capability in the AI landscape. This isn't just about cost. It's about changing who can leverage advanced AI tools. Stick around to see how this release is challenging competitors and democratizing AI in ways we've never seen before. Let's break it down. Google's decision to offer Gemini 2.0 Flash, thinking for free during its beta testing phase, is a bold, calculated move that redefines access to advanced AI. At a time when many cutting-edge AI tools are locked behind expensive paywalls, Google's approach stands out as a stark contrast. Google's strategy is clear. Advanced AI should be accessible to everyone, not just those who can afford it. This aligns seamlessly with their broader vision of integrating AI into everyday life. By bridging the gap between innovation and affordability, Google isn't merely competing with OpenAI. It's reshaping the landscape of who gets to leverage advanced AI tools and how they can be used. The release of Gemini 2.0 couldn't have come at a more critical time. The demand for AI tools is surging, yet concerns over their affordability and accessibility continue to grow. Smaller developers and enterprises often find themselves unable to justify the high costs of premium AI solutions, creating a significant gap in the market. Google's free offering directly addresses this issue, providing a lifeline for those who need advanced tools but lack the resources to pay for them. This strategic move also places immense pressure on competitors like OpenAI to reassess their pricing strategies. While OpenAI's models remain highly capable, the introduction of a free alternative forces a pivotal question. Is it still worth paying a premium when a free option with competitive capabilities exists? The ripple effects of this decision could fundamentally reshape the dynamics of the AI market, forcing established players to rethink their value propositions and accessibility. What makes Gemini 2.0 Flash thinking a game changer? So Google now announcing the next generation of its large language model, Gemini 2.0, what it's calling the next era of models built for the agentic era. An experimental version called Gemini Flash, that'll be available today to all users, along with new features that include reasoning capability and advances in multimodality, all meant to get us closer to that next leg of this AI race, a universal personal assistant or agent. One of the standout features of Gemini 2.0 Flash thinking is its ability to process large-scale data efficiently. While specific token limits for Gemini 2.0 or OpenAI's O1 Pro remain undisclosed, the system is built to handle extensive data sets and complex tasks. Imagine analyzing an entire library of research papers at once or processing multiple books in a single session. For researchers, developers, and professionals working with extensive data sets, this capability eliminates many of the limitations that have historically hindered productivity and analysis. From sifting through legal documents to decoding scientific literature or even debugging massive code bases, Gemini 2.0 redefines what's possible with AI. In terms of performance, Gemini 2.0 exceeds expectations. It achieved 73.3% on the American Invitational Mathematics Examination, AIME, and 74.2% on the GPQA Diamond Science Benchmark, demonstrating strong reasoning and computational capabilities. While OpenAI's O3 model reportedly performs better in some benchmarks, Gemini 2.0's results remain competitive, especially given its accessibility. Compared to earlier versions, the 2.0 model represents a significant leap forward, excelling in tasks that require advanced logic and critical thinking. It's not only faster, but also smarter, making it a powerful tool for complex problem solving. 
Another transformative feature is Gemini 2.0's native code execution capability. This allows developers to run and test code directly within the system, a practical addition that simplifies workflows and saves time. Instead of juggling between separate environments for coding and testing, developers can debug software or test new snippets seamlessly. This feature is a reliability booster for technical tasks. Whether building applications, creating machine learning models, or running simulations, this integrated functionality streamlines processes and adds value for anyone working in tech. With Gemini 2.0, the combination of advanced reasoning, expanded processing capacity, and integrated coding tools makes it a true game changer in the AI space. In addition to these technical breakthroughs, Gemini 2.0 addresses a critical challenge in AI systems, the need for greater transparency and trust in how decisions are made. The black box problem has long plagued AI systems, where models provide answers without explaining how they arrived at them. This lack of transparency is especially concerning in critical fields like healthcare, finance, and education, where trust and understanding are essential. Without clear reasoning, decisions can feel unreliable and even risky, such as in medical diagnoses or financial compliance. Project Astra is a team and a project and a prototype um, aiming to build uh, an AI assistant with eyes, ears, and a voice that's co-present with you. So it uh, is with you in any place you're, you are. So uh, either through smart glasses or your phone or your computer, it can see what you're doing. It can talk to you about it. Like a little assistant that sits on your shoulder. Yeah, yeah, like a little parrot on your shoulder that's hanging out with you and talking to you about the world. Gemini 2.0 addresses this by not just delivering answers, but also explaining its thought process. This breakthrough eliminates uncertainty, whether solving complex problems, analyzing data, or generating ideas. By showing its work, Gemini 2.0 builds trust and confidence, making its outputs more reliable and actionable. The implications are far-reaching. In healthcare, it could improve diagnostics by clarifying recommendations. In finance, it enhances compliance with transparent decision-making. In education, it serves as a teaching tool, breaking down complex concepts. This transparency also lowers skepticism, encouraging wider AI adoption in workplaces and classrooms alike, where accountability and understanding are critical. So how does Google outshine OpenAI? Google's decision to release Gemini 2.0, flash thinking for free during its beta phase, represents a seismic shift in the AI industry. Unlike OpenAI's premium models, where costs can range from $20 per task in low compute mode to $3,500 per task for high compute operations, Google's approach eliminates financial barriers for accessing advanced AI capabilities. This strategic move democratizes AI making it accessible to smaller developers, researchers, and businesses that previously couldn't afford high subscription costs. By prioritizing inclusivity, Google is forcing competitors to reconsider their pricing strategies while expanding the potential user base for advanced AI. What truly sets Google apart isn't just its pricing model, it's the company's broader vision and track record in AI innovation. Over the years, Google has led transformative projects like AlphaGo, which revolutionized planning systems and has continually pushed boundaries in AI development. Gemini 2.0 builds on this legacy, combining years of research with cutting edge advancements like reasoning, transparency, and integrated functionality for technical tasks. Google's transparency first approach is another area where it distinguishes itself from competitors. With its ability to explain its reasoning, Gemini 2.0 addresses one of AI's most significant challenges, Trust. This feature is a game changer in critical fields like healthcare, finance, and education, where understanding the logic behind AI decisions is essential. By embedding transparency into its system, Google is not only advancing the technology, but also fostering broader acceptance of AI in industries that demand accountability. The release of Gemini 2.0 also signals Google's intent to redefine the AI landscape. Its focus on accessibility, transparency, and long-term innovation positions it as more than just a competitor to open AI. Google is setting a new standard for how advanced AI should be developed, distributed, and integrated into the real world.
The launch of Gemini 2.0 has significant implications for the AI industry. Beyond transparency, Gemini 2.0 underscores the potential for the democratization of AI. By making high-performing tools freely available, Google empowers startups, researchers, and smaller businesses to leverage advanced AI without incurring prohibitive costs. This could lead to an explosion of innovation across industries as more people gain access to tools that were previously out of reach. While Gemini 2.0 shows great promise, it isn't without challenges. Benchmark scores, while impressive, don't always translate to flawless performance in real-world applications. Complex, nuanced tasks may still expose limitations in the model's capabilities. Additionally, convincing enterprises to adopt a free model over established paid alternatives may be difficult, as many associate costs with reliability and long-term support. Addressing these perceptions will require consistent performance and robust endorsements from early adopters. The release of Gemini 2.0 also raises the stakes in the ongoing AI competition. OpenAI, Microsoft, and other players will likely respond with innovations of their own, intensifying the race to lead the AI space. For OpenAI, its premium pricing model, which ranges from $20 per task for low compute operations to $3,500 for high compute tasks, positions it as a solution for enterprise-level capabilities. However, Google's free access strategy may shift the conversation, pressuring competitors to reconsider their pricing and accessibility. With Gemini 2.0 flash thinking, Google has introduced a model that challenges the status quo in AI. Its free access, groundbreaking features, and focus on transparency mark a shift toward a more inclusive and competitive AI landscape. Whether this move will redefine the industry or force competitors like OpenAI to adapt remains to be seen. But one thing is certain, the AI arms race just got a lot more interesting. If you've made it this far, let us know what you think in the comment section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.